Hey guys, it's Sarah. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. Today's video is our favorite video and that's a Dollar Tree haul. Da -da -da -da. This is a Dollar Tree haul that you need to watch before going back into Dollar Tree. We have so many new amazing finds that I am so excited to share. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you happen to be new and if you didn't see any of my previous videos, go and check them out because we are just giving tons of information about how to shop like a pro at Dollar Tree. All right, y'all, without further ado, I always like to start with the thing that I was most excited about and I was most excited about. Da -da -da -da. These Jot water bottle stickers. Now, I told you guys before I need to stop buying stickers, but I thought that these were different. Number one, they're absolutely gorgeous gorgeous there's not any glitter no sparkle they say that they're water and heat resistant and they're basically a way for you to decorate your bottle they had a few different styles so they had like some little pets ones they had a whole bunch of different ones can you just see how gorgeous they are and they're like good quality they're like a little bit more shiny rather than matte so i guess i'm gonna just start putting them around the water bottle Ooh, they're nice spring break here in Philly so if you hear kids screaming that's what it is there's a bunch of kids outside <gasps> how beautiful I absolutely love the color of these they're so beautiful craft stuff from crafter square they had these clear stamps it's a 12 piece thing of stamps so this one just had like little hearts this one says kiss and love it has i love you a little heart with mailbox which i think is adorable and then this one is all about travel so it says travel summer a little watermelon so over on tiktok i saw ways to use like a stamp to stamp your toilet paper once you like clean your bathroom as like a final like little piece of pizzazz i guess and i thought this would be fun to use but you could also use these in diys and i thought for a dollar 25 these clear stamps are super cute but i thought it would be cute to like maybe like put like the little heart mason jar on the toilet paper so this is from floral garden it's called wood curl roses and you guys know those large round bamboo like rings i thought this would be cute to put like around those in some type of way so i got two of them they come in a four piece set i thought they were so different and they're definitely like my style so i really like those again from the same floral garden they have this burlap trim so this is a really cute thing that you could put around a candle you could put around like a little mason jar i really like it it's um one yard of each little style and then here are some different stickers which i thought were really gorgeous because they're gold whenever i think about like a boho style i feel like feathers are always in there so this little light bulb terrarium is not in the craft section but i want to share an easy craft that you can do with it you use these light bulb terrariums inside you take one pack of the dollar tree led lights they do need batteries, so you need two AA batteries. You're also going to take some of the Dollar Tree moss and some of the Dollar Tree succulents. You're going to put the battery pack inside of the terrarium right in the front. You can hide the battery pack underneath the moss, put moss on top, and put the succulents in. Now you can hang this indoor or outdoor, and with the lights at night, it's going to look gorgeous, and I think that it's the perfect summer DIY that you can do in a pinch. I know Dollar Tree right now has those little hanging hooks that you put into the ground, you could put a couple of those all around the backyard. I think that would look really, really beautiful. Let me know in the comments down below, would this be safe to use as a bird feeder? Because I did get some Dollar Tree bird seed and I thought maybe I could put that inside of here and then put this up for the birds. But let me know if that's safe for them. I got this seed starting potting mix. So it says grow bulbs, root cuttings, all purpose, ideal for house plants. So we have the Dollar Tree bulbs and I'll share with you guys a picture of my Dollar Tree tomato plants that I got and I shared that in a previous haul. The ones are sprouting. The basil did not sprout. I think she died. I saw a little bit of mold. I'm trying to bring her back to life but she's not doing well. But my tomato plants, those have sprouted so I'm waiting for them to do their thing. Um, but I want to give the Dollar Tree bulbs a, uh, a try and they said that it needed potting soil. So I'm not sure if this is the correct stuff but I'm going to look online and if it is I'm going to use it and I'm going to put the Dollar Tree bulbs in here. Also in the garden section I saw this sprinkler. It's a little frog. How stinking cute is he? It's absolutely nothing fancy but basically you stake it into the ground. 
you put this on top you put your hose inside and then it's going to shoot out all of the water i'm excited to try this this one is more like home decor but i'm going to include it with the craft stuff it's the luminous floating candles i feel like i haven't seen these in such a long time these are really good and plan on using them as, as a centerpiece for easter it comes with two of the floating candles inside each one for a dollar 25 dollar tree had a bunch of these embroidery needles they had a bunch of cute patterns on the front so basically you stick all your pins in here now i don't do embroidery but i thought this one was really really cute and i really like the fabric that's on the front so i got that just in case a new find a Dollar Tree are these little dusters and basically when you buy it it comes like all up like this and it's basically a soft bristle it's considered a soft bristle um, feather duster as soon as I got this I used this in our truck and it worked so good so definitely pick these up it has the little part where you can put the Dollar Tree like the long handle inside of here or you can just keep it like this, which I think is probably the best option. But for $1.25, you cannot beat that with a bat. Typically, I'm not a huge Bolero fan. I typically pass on their stuff. But when I saw this shimmering body mist, I thought for summer, this is going to be fantastic. So I picked up one that's in Cool Cucumber. You could put this in the fridge. You could spray your legs. You could spray your arms if you want a little summer glow. And then um, I also got this one in Calming Lavender. Like, I don't like glitter. But I like a little bit of shimmer, especially in the summer. I feel like oh, like a baby oil with highlighter in there. It's my kind of thing. Okay. I definitely don't smell anything. It has a slight scent. It's hard to tell. Can you see a difference? So maybe you can mix this with like a body oil or like the baby oil the lavender oil some type of oil like sometimes I feel like the oil is what does it the oil mixed with the shimmer can look really nice I'm on the fence with this one if you saw a previous video where I shared these YAA you are amazing lavender rose and daisy oils um, I got two of those they say that they retail for five dollars well when I was at Dollar Tree the other day I saw that they have this body scrub so it's the you are amazing they say that this retails for three dollars hydrating body scrub and wash so i'm going to put these two together and put them in a gift basket i feel like that's good i'm not going to open them and then look how cute this little guy is but i feel like inside of a basket these are absolutely adorable because all of the colors go so well together and i'm sure that this little loofah is not going to be the best quality but he is sure too cute to not add together because the idea is just adorable so if you have a young kid maybe for doing their back it could be good but I love the color combination I think that it's super cute I forgot to share that I finally found these two shelves at Dollar Tree these are just like the wall shelves they're 15.7 inches long I believe um comes with the rope it comes with the little the paddle piece I wasn't sure where I was going to put these but I feel like these are cute you could do a lot with them that's cute I like that for just a dollar 25 fantastic can't beat that with a bat so I'm glad that I got two of those. Another beauty item that I picked up was from Scrunchie. They had like, they had it in a white and a few other colors. This is just a cute little white headband that I plan on using. I got this Salon Selective Heat Protectant. This was my first time seeing this, so I did pick it up. I feel like you always need a heat protectant regardless what type of hair you have. So I'm excited to give this a try. For the Easter basket giveaway, I picked up the Wet n Wild um, Perfume Rollerball. I loved this one. I had the one that was more purple, and I definitely would recommend it for just $1.25 it was fantastic I also got the NYX full throttle eyeshadow stick I feel like these are really really good and I like this color like any type of like greenish blue I really am drawn to so I got that one and then the last thing that I well another thing and it's not the last thing but it's another thing that I got from Dollar Tree uh, this is basically hold your phone so when you're getting ready and you're doing your makeup you can prop your phone up inside of the back of the whale and it keeps your phone upright so that you can watch your shows and I love that it's pink look how cute this phone case is it reminds Reminds me of like those little peach emojis but it has like the purple background and then it has the peaches on the front and it feels like matte so it's not shiny it's matte so we like that a lot and then the last but not least well one of the final things for the giveaway is this bath bomb it's from the brand body and it's called the pink vanilla wish 
uh, bath bomb. It smells so good. I absolutely am obsessed. I feel like I'm always talking about how good it is. Look at these socks. It's from their brand Mini Chi, I believe. It says size 4 to 10. They have like the little polka dots, the black and white polka dots. These are basically like the little socks where you can't see your actual socks. I rarely wear socks, but when I do, I like these kind. I haven't got a ton of food recently from Dollar Tree, but I did pick up these from Jelly Belly. It's the powder drink mix in Berry Blue. I absolutely love these for my kids. It allows them to drink more water and less juice. I want to give one a try. I got my water right here. We're going to put it in here. It smells like very blue. Wow, it smells just like cotton candy. It has like that blue raspberry taste, but like without sugar, without like that fake taste sometimes. It tastes good. I like that a lot. So this is in the garden section. It basically says welcome bees and butterflies. It has butterflies, it has bees, and they're in a really gorgeous color. So I thought this would be good for doing like a DIY door wreath. They also had these little stakes that you can put in the ground. This one says give kindness daily. They had a bunch of other little sayings on here. Every year Dollar Tree brings these out around summertime. They have clear and they have different colors. Typically the clear ones sell out super fast. So I did get two of them. Basically, you can push to have the drink come out. They're not very big in size. I don't know. I would say maybe like 16 ounces. It's not a lot, but they are useful. You can use them in a few different ways, so I'm glad I got those. There are lots of unfinished wooden pieces like this now coming to Dollar Tree. This one just says home, so maybe I can use this and then the butterflies and then make a door wreath like that. That sounds fun, so... Easter I got these little printed bunny feet so I'm going to put those out Easter morning so I thought that would be really fun. For Quincy for an Easter basket filler I picked up these little tattoos which I think are adorable. They even had like um Avengers ones and then I also got this book to put in. It's a trolls book. I don't know what age it says but it says Disney Trolls World but I thought it'd be fun that we could sit down and read it together so that he has something to do, something he needs, something he can use, something he can play. That's what I typically try to do for Easter. Uh, two more things I want to share. There was these new card games out. It's called Be the First to Unscramble the Celebrity. It's called Mishmash. And there was another one that had all different phrases all jumbled up. The kids and I played that one. It was six and up. That was a good time. It does go by pretty fast. Like you use the cards up fast, but it was fun to play with the kids. This one is ages 12 and up. So I thought I could give this one to Bobby for inside of his Easter basket. And it would be something fun that we can play together. So these are the Dollar Tree to go coffee cups. And I absolutely absolutely love them. They had some for Valentine's Day. I definitely think they should do more for seasons because it would be super duper fun, but I love the Valentine's Day ones. These ones come in a four, a four pack, so they come with the top. They also come with this type of thing, you know, so you don't burn your hand, but I love these for mornings when you're like on the go. If the kids have uh, football games and stuff like that, I would make a cup for me and my husband and we would reuse the cups. I might be a dirty girl, but I'm like, I'm not throwing these cups out, but I really like them. If you have people that you have come over often, they're just nice to have on hand. They look really good inside of the coffee bar and I would definitely recommend them. These are a pattern I feel like I've never seen before, but we are going to decorate our coffee bar for spring and we're going to use these. The last things that I want to share real quick are the sunglasses. Look at these. How stinking cute. I've been obsessed. If you didn't see over on Instagram, I made a DIY sunglass holder. You should try to make that and go look for sunglasses at Dollar Tree because it's like a hunt. They have super cute ones. These have like little daisies on there. Super retro, kind of 70s vibes. Love those. So I've been adding those to my collection. If you want to enter the giveaway, check in the description box below for all of the rules and all of the details. You must be a subscriber. And also, if you want to be entered, the way that I'll be able to know is by you leaving your favorite holiday in the comment section down below. This giveaway will last for one week. It'll start from today and it'll go for seven days. I will notify the winner in the comment section of the video. I will send you 
a way to contact me either through email or DM. And once you contact me, then you'll have one day to get back to me and I'll send it out. Please, y'all, I want this to be fun. I want it to be something enjoyable. I want it to be something as a way just to give back. So I know that it's not a lot, but I have been going shopping for this stuff. And rather than just see it sit in my house, I'd rather give it to somebody that may want it. So I love you guys so stinking much. And I'm so grateful to have you here. I hope that this gave you an idea of what's new at Dollar Tree, what's to come. Dollar Tree has a whole summer line about to come out. So I am just fingers crossed waiting to get it. I have not seen it at any of my stores, but it's definitely all beach themed and it's going to be fantastic so subscribe to the channel if you're into dollar tree i'm a mom from philly i'm all about life on a budget if you can relate to that i would love to have you give the video a thumbs up because it helps me out it helps my channel not to die and i really appreciate it and if you want to follow me over on social media i am over there 24 7 i'm just at sensational finds i love you guys i hope wherever you are you are safe happy and healthy and doing amazing and i will see you guys next time for another video bye you guys